my name's Anne-Marie and I'm going to show you how to make a mini farm for the Eka School Gardens competition. So, you will need sphagnum moss, seeds, a growing tray, water and a bucket. Sphagnum moss is amazing. There's over 400 different types of sphagnum moss and it acts as a sponge. I'll show you what it looks like. Uh, you probably need about half a packet, but just start with a small amount and see how you go. So that's it in the bucket. And then you just add water. So you can see as it soaks in, it really does take that water up and you sort of work it through, allowing all that sphagnum to go from dry to wet. So we'll line the base of the tray with it to begin with, about three quarters of the way up the size of the tray. Now, uh, we have our wheatgrass seeds. They're quite large, which is an advantage working with children. Uh, just tear off the top. The seeds germinate within around about three to seven days. This is what the seeds look like. So they're, they're quite large. They're a similar colour to the sphagnum. And I would suggest that you just get the children to sprinkle them. If you really would like to, you could mimic a, a farm that's growing some crops and perhaps do them in rows. So we've got our seeds in our tray. You might be able to see them. And now we're going to get the, some more sphagnum and we're going to cover the seeds around about a depth of around about um, a centimetre, a centimetre and a half. Just lay it on top. Water it initially. So just water it. Uh, watering can is really good for this because it's a gentle flow and it won't disturb or dislodge the seeds. And now you place this in a sunny position. You can place it outdoors, you can place it in a bright lit position where it's going to get around about two hours of sunlight. Okay, so this one was planted around about a week ago. Um, I've made a little mound here just to give the farm a little bit of a hill. And these are some of the characters that um, I'm going to put into the farm. So you can do all sorts of things for your mini farm. You can do machinery. You could do maybe a solar farm or a wind farm. There's a lot of different uh, farms out there and I'm sure that you can use your imagination to grow your own mini farm. Thank you for watching. You can enter your mini farm in this year's School Garden Competition for the Echo.